Alrighty, hello guys, so can be fixed this back to another Stormworks search and destroy video. Today we are actually building a water plane or a sea plane as you guys can see. Uh, and we actually ended up building the full fuselage last time. Now it is floating, but it is not floating precisely like how we want it. Uh, but that is because we don't have any wings yet, we don't have any pontoons yet, and yeah, the whole thing isn't done, so that's why we are on our side. But anyway, today what I figured we'd do is we'd actually go ahead and build up from here. Uh, and build like the start of the wings and maybe even implement the engines. So let's go ahead and do that, shall we? Okie dokie, so we are actually going to build the wings a little bit like the PBY um, because I feel like we should and I kind of want to. So we're going to delete that right there and we are going to build a little section out like this. And that is where we are going to build the uh, the wings from, the engines and stuff. So we're going to go ahead and put this on both sides. There we go, just like this. And honestly, we're going to make it go all the way to there. So if I can do something like this, that'd be great. And we can just do that. That's awesome. Uh, and we can sort of have it go up from there. That is completely fine uh, to do it just like this. One, two, three, just like that. And I guess we can just have this be as big as we want it to or as small as we want it to. Uh, so we're going to go up three there as well, and it is probably going to be two, actually. There we go. We'll go up two. That seems fine. Yeah. All right, cool. Fill that in right there. That's awesome. Go ahead and fill it in on the back as well, and the wing will start on top of there. That's cool. Okie dokie. I do kind of feel like it should be a little bit bigger than that, though. So what we're going to do as well is we're going to attach this onto here uh, like that, and we'll actually extend that upwards just a little bit like this. Uh, and I feel like that could actually look really awesome. So we'll go ahead and do that like that. That's really, really cool. We'll go ahead and attach these guys together like so, and we'll seal this bit too. One there and one there. All right, very cool. That actually looks pretty sick. Uh, is there anything else that we really, really like to do? I think I'm going to delete this all the way across there, uh, which means I'll delete these guys as well, because what are they? I don't know. Uh, and we'll actually go ahead and put this in uh, just below this. Whoop, just like this. That's good. And we'll actually seal this straight onto here just like this. Bam! There we go. All right, that is awesome, actually. Yeah, it looks weird, but uh, we need some support for the engine, and that is how we're going to do it. Good. You know, this does also mean that we don't really need any of this inside of here either, so we can actually save on a hell of a lot of room, and we can also put stuff in here if necessary, which is awesome. Actually, that is really, really cool. So delete all of that backwards. There we go. And we've got so much extra space. Yes, indeed we do. All right, cool. Good, so we're going to leave that like that. That is awesome. So now we need to attach an engine, sorry, the wings, uh, to the top of this. And the wings themselves are going to look like this. So we're going to have one there. We're going to go ahead and put a block right there. And then we're going to do this on the top. And that's it. The wings are actually going to be that big. And that's fine. All right, cool. So the front of the wing is actually pretty much going to be flat all the way along anyway. So I'll do something like this. That's good. Uh, but we'll only do it a short distance for now. Because we're going to add the engines to this. That's fine. We'll go ahead and do that right there. And honestly, we'll put this on the top. All right, there we go. All right, that is looking pretty crazy so far. Pretty crazy. All right, wings. This is where we start next. Wing sections. So this needs to go in here like this. However, there is a problem. We can't put it there because we need to do something with this piece. All right, bam. There we go. We'll go ahead and put a few of those on. All right, very good. And then we can actually attach this straight onto there, and now it'll fit. Good. We'll then do the same thing. One, two, three, and we'll put another one in. There we go. And then we'll probably actually put another one in as well. There we go. Another one. Very good. We'll then put another one in, but not the same. One, two, three. There we go. Uh, and it'll actually be... Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? The small ones. Here we go. Uh, in fact, actually, delete this one. It'll start there. There we go. That's pretty sick. That's pretty sick. Okay, good. So now we actually want it to go here instead. Okay, that's good. And we can actually build it straight off this one, just like this. And that is maze balls. Very good. We can then attach another one of these to each side, Boop, just like so. And that's pretty cool. However, I'm actually thinking it needs to go here instead. Uh, now that I think about it, because yeah, reasons. All right, cool. Do this, this, this. Go ahead and build it in. Easy peasy, just like that. Very good. Delete all of those. Delete all of that. And whack that on there. Okay, that's pretty good. That is pretty good. Okay, so then, if we want it to continue down, 
we'll just attach that piece on to there and that piece on to there and that is all good that is all good very nice okay so now if I do this boop, that's good we can actually attach these guys on to actually delete that and that you can probably just put this in there we go just like this seal that bit up that's okay and yeah that's okay right I think that's fine cool that's awesome nice very nice okay so the engines are gonna go here and here I think that'll be okay uh, and the wing sections I do want it to sort of work properly so I think this wing section right here sort of has to go back on itself which is weird but if we can make it work properly that'd be great that would actually be fantastic if it did that that'd be awesome uh, all right okay so then we'll attach all of these together obviously uh, but we need to do it with wings okay so it's a little bit lighter and that is pretty good that's really good so with this design we'll actually be able to have um fuel inside of here this little bit right here which is awesome we'll actually seal this up and yeah we can fill it with fuel um so that'll be one of our fuel tanks and then it'll actually go up into this which will also be a fuel tank and then the engine will go here all right cool seal that off right there that's awesome and start building our engines in now i don't know how this is gonna go i'm not gonna lie to you i don't know how this is gonna look and i i don't know how we're gonna make it look good but we're gonna try our best and that's all that matters okie dokie so let's go ahead and delete this piece right here we'll also delete one two three four five this one and honestly we'll actually put in pieces like i was gonna do this there we go right there and this right here delete all the middle section and that is gonna be our engine uh compartment bit right there okay very good that's actually pretty nice so they're gonna be relatively large uh considering our plane is not that big there we go and that is where they're gonna go let me just grab a propeller we'll attach it straight on so rotor light it is probably gonna be the light rotors that's fine we'll put it right there and we'll make them big all right there we go big and big and probably three blades i'd imagine i don't know uh yeah they'd go right there that's awesome yeah okay so with that being said then we actually want uh this to go right here there we go delete this piece and whack that in right there we'll also delete this piece and we'll whack this bit in right there okie dokie we're then gonna do uh one more down like this and one more down like that there we go delete this this and all of this actually and then put these two together whoop there we go okay so is it like that how we want it i don't think it is you know i feel like i want it to be higher which is strange but i think we can make it work i think we can make it work okay so uh then that would go there and we delete all of this okay okie dokie which is gonna make it wider to begin with but don't worry so that's gonna go like that this is gonna go like this okay grab another one of these news put it on top of here very good and extend that straight across okay very good this is no longer the center of the engine that's fine delete these guys all the way around sorry if i'm uh i don't know i'm sorry if this is gonna take more time but it's what i want to do so there we go that would go down there delete that piece is this exactly the same as how we had it i'm not sure there we go across there that's still too low we want it to be higher so we'd actually have the engines not be circular and then that would work yeah all right cool that works uh seal all this off for now and that is where our engines are gonna go all right cool okie dokie so with that being said then let's go ahead and extend this backwards just a little bit like this there we go just a little bit right here as well one two uh one two two one two there we go very good do these pieces uh, one two ah no one two there we go one two very good and then seal this off one two three four very good and do this on the top all right cool so let's say this is our engine then we want it to sort of merge with the wing somehow i don't know how this is gonna happen because the wings aren't that big <laughs> the wings are not that big look at it look at it they i think the wing needs to be bigger actually doesn't it that's too small that's way too small so delete these guys delete that okay we can have a section in here this fits so that fits right there we can actually fit that in as well delete these guys 
And the engine can be even bigger than that. There we go. So the wings can actually go all the way backwards to there. And then the engines can sort of fit on there, I think. If we do it right, anyway. So this would end up coming down. Like that into the wing. Okay, very good. We then have to do a similar bit with this. So that would go down into the wing, which is there. That would go down into the wing also, which is there. And that's pretty sick. So this would continue. One, two, three. Okay, that would continue just like that. That's fine. And honestly, this would just go down like this as well. And that's it. They're sort of on at that point. They're on. Okay, very good. We're going to have the back bit be flat, which seems strange, but don't worry about it. It's okay. There we go. Do that. Delete the top one. Put one of these guys in because it needs to. Turn it around. Whack this one on here. Bam. Fill this in. Do something with this. I don't know. Like that. One, two, three. And have a little flat piece right there. Okay, cool. So if those are going to be our engines, uh, that's fine. As long as we can sort of seal everything else together and make it look right. So um, on this side of the wing, we need it to do something like that. That's okay. Good. We then need it to come down from about the same place. So I'm actually thinking we delete this. We have this piece go in here like this. For a, a tiny section. Maybe just those two. And then we continue from there. So I need to seal this up so that it looks like it's working. And that's alright, isn't it? That is that is okie dokie. That's kind of cool. Alright, so if that was working like that. We then need the bottoms of the wings to be attached back on. Uh, which is going to go just like this. One there, one there, one there. And I guess actually one there. And then maybe even one in the middle of here. Uh, ooh, like this, there we go, uh, and that looks way, way, way better actually, I think, yeah. I still don't know whether it's too big though, oh, sorry, too small, I should say, because I feel like it should be bigger, but I don't know. Okie dokie, so I've deleted the interior of this, uh, it was full of stuff, but that's okay, so we've deleted that, we're then going to go into this and drag this backwards pretty much all the way to, uh, there, and then we'll seal it off actually, so we'll actually... Uh, just do something like this uh, right about here and that'll be okay. We then need to do a similar thing on this side do 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 all the way to There very good go ahead and put this piece on like so and attach it all together Using this Meow. All right, very good seal that in it's literally just gonna be flat on the bottom and that's okay I think that looks pretty good actually uh, and then we'll need some supports for it. Okay, so The way that's gonna have to work is we'll have a support right there We'll have a support right here, and it's essentially just going to do this up to the wing. There we go. Uh, this piece, also exactly the same, but up to the wing. <laughs> Wherever the wing is. I don't know where the wing is, but there you go. And then if we seal all this together, so one there, one there, one there. We can then do all of this, just like that. And then all of this, just like this. And then uh, we'll continue with this bit in a second. But essentially, that's going to go there like that. And that's going to be fine. We get our supports for our wings, for our engines. That looks sick. Okie dokie. So now we need to figure out how the engines are going to work. We're going to go and delete a bunch of this. And we're going to put some thingamabobbies in. Some fluid pots. Uh, the reason I'm doing this is because it should look pretty good if we do this. We can also use them. So that's obviously very nice too. But uh, the middle one is going to have to go. There we go. We're going to have some very, very interesting problems with this um since we're actually adding the uh the propellers to the top we're gonna have to have some sort of measure that makes it go up instead of pitching us straight down into the water because that's what's gonna happen but we'll try our best to make sure that that doesn't happen but i guess we'll see anyway paint all that like that that's good and yeah that's fine we'll leave it literally just like that for now get ourselves some propellers and whack them on. There we go. Propeller end light. We can't actually put it straight there, which is unfortunate. Uh, which is very unfortunate, actually. Because then we have to make the propellers look better. Oh, God. Oh, lordy. Okay, so something like that. That's very good. Make it big. Make it three blades. Make it big. Three blades. And that's not going to work. 
because as soon as these spin, they're actually going to hit the uh, the main body. So realistically, we should move the engine slightly further left and slightly further right, and then we won't have a problem with that. But I'll have a problem with the rest of it, won't we? Because I, I do want them like really close together. Right, you know what? Make it smaller. Make it 70% instead. 70% instead. And honestly, we'll just put some motors to these, and we'll see if they actually hit. Here we go. So motor's going to go right there. Motor's going to go right there. Battery. Do, 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 do. Boop. And yeah, okay. So attach this to... Wait, what? Why? How did I... How did I put two motors in there? Okay, so we'll do that and that. And then actually we'll just do this. Let's connect the battery up. That's fine. Uh, and we'll see them spinning. Okay, make them neutral so that it doesn't move. And go! Perfect! They don't hit the body! They don't hit the body! But if we made them bigger, do they still hit the body? Or do they do they not? I don't know, let's see. They're not hitting the body. That's really good, actually. That's really, really good! Nice! Okay, cool. So we can actually have them massive, that's fine. Uh, we'll delete that, and we'll delete... Oh, that one's already gone. Alright, cool. Good! Guys, I'm really happy with this. Okie dokie, so now you might be asking, where the hell did you get this from? So this thing right here is actually a V, well, it's actually a 12 cylinder engine. Uh, and I figured we could use it because it is a modular engine and it should be powerful enough to run this. Uh, but essentially, this is what we will be using. This is a 12 cylinder uh, engine, which is good. So this thing right here is out of my World War II plane and this is going to be a World War II plane, so that's good. Uh, we need to obviously fit all of these bits together, but that's okay. So if we put that right there, we take it straight to the other side and we do exactly the same thing. Boop! It actually fits in uh, perfectly. Yeah, everything actually works. Alright, cool. So now that that's in, what we need to do is we actually need to put some blocks in to make this work fully. Essentially, we need some pipes. Da -da 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 -da. Some angled pipes. We're going to go ahead and attach that to there. Attach it to there. Attach it to there. And attach it to there. And then we can merge this with the bottom. Boop. There we go. Do the same thing on the other side as well. Boop. There we go. And those engines should now sort of work, which is great. We then need some gearboxes, so it does actually work. Gear. Here we go. Gear. Gearboxes. All right, we'll put that on there like that. That's awesome. Delete that battery because it is unnecessary. And we are good. All right, so this thing right here is the fuel. We need the fuel to go in there. This right here is the exhaust. And this right here is the... Exhaust also, question mark. It's also the exhaust. And then this bit on the back is the air. So we need an air supply somewhere. It can come sideways up and out the front. Because it can actually go here, that is fine. Uh, and we will actually make it white. There we go, that's fine. And actually we'll have it sideways too. Ooh, actually no. Inbe unbelievably, we can have it just like this. Alright, so put this block right there. We can have a fluid, oh I don't know what it's called. This thing, an, an intake. There we go. You can have an intake on right there. And that actually looks sick. That looks really good. Okay, so if we then put this right here, this right here. Where? Whoa, whoa, to the side. Our air supply can actually go through there. And that is fine. That would be awesome. Okay, so how do we go about doing this then? I don't really know. Right, okay, pipe. Here we go. So we're going to go uh, sideways and then up and then front. And then that's it. Sideways, front, up. That's it. Air supply attached. Alright, not quite. There we go. Air supply attached. Very good. This is the exhaust. Um, do kind of want the exhaust coming out the side of this, but I don't know where to do that. Unless it was here, but no. I want it to go... We need catalytic converters. And then we'll see. But I think it should come out the top. Maybe it should come out the top. Ooh, that's a difficult one. I don't know. I don't know. Um, delete this. Have it come this way. And then we can just use pipes and stuff and make it go wherever we want. We can't have it go at the top. Make it go back where it was. Can we have it go at the back of here? Yeah, we can. And then the same right here as well. Oh, that's good. Yeah, we'll do that. Okie dokie. So how am I going to make that look right? So I think what we'll do is we'll have a pipe enclosed, a straight one, uh, right there. We'll also have another one right there. And we will be attaching these to the right places. Don't you worry. We'll then do that. And we'll do that. Good. So this is going to have to connect up with that one, which is fine. We can totally do this. There we go. Up to there. Get an angled piece. Put it down. Put it up. There we go. Right, cool. So one is attached. 
We then need this one to be attached. So down, backwards, straight pipe, uh, and that's it. All right, one, two. All right, so that exhaust is also done. This is our fuel mixture, and that is the last thing that actually needs to be done. So it can come down the front of the engine, in through here, into the... Uh, no. <laughs> Whoa, no. Uh, back this way, and this can all be fuel. Actually, yeah, so delete the wings. That's fine. There we go. And if we fill this in so that it actually fits properly, we can have some sort of fuel tank in the middle. And that'll be okay. Yeah, so uh, if we do this and this and this and this we've got our fuel tank ready right here in the center of the aircraft and i think that'll work also it's really high which is a good thing right so this being the exhaust uh we'll actually do that delete this one put a block right there exhaust can i get a thing for this yes i can okay ready put that there put that there and we've got our exhaust coming out the back of our engines that looks sick but now we need our fuel to get to our our place. <laughs> we need our fuel to get to our place. So it actually just needs to go in there. So if we can, we need to get a pipe. We need it to go straight to the right. There we go. We need straight pipes. One, two. Uh, and then honestly, we need it to go... No, just one. Just one. Grab this. Make it go sideways. Make it go down. There we go. Make it come straight down. That'd be great. Here we go. One there. And then angle it this way. Very good. And then fluid port in there. And we'll be good, I think. Here we go. Fluid port. Bam. As long as this is sealed, which I think it is, uh, we will be good. But I don't know. I don't know if it's sealed. I don't know if wing pieces actually seal things either. So that's an issue. But anyway, that's all good. Uh, let's go ahead and put some things in fluid things and we'll see if it works so spawner put it right there and a meter just so we can see if it's full uh it can go in as well where's the meter meter there we go fluid meter put that right there as well and that'll be great okie dokie dial that is the next thing we need a dial go ahead and put it right on the top make sure we've actually got water in there fluid level and go Okay, so it's heavy on the top now, which is nice. That's good. Uh, it means that we have fuel. Yes, it does. 3,000 fuel. That's actually really good. That's really, really good. Okay, so 3,000 fuel. That's awesome. Um, delete that now. No longer necessary. Our engines should work. Let's go ahead and save this real quick. And we'll get the microcontroller that Billy's made. And we'll use it on the engines. And hopefully they'll work too. All right, so this is the microcontroller Billy has made, and it is raring to go. So I think we'll have to do it on both engines, that's okay. So we'll have to have two of these actually put into our machine, which will be fine. So if we actually put this, like, let's say, uh, ooh, no, let's not. Let's not say there. We'll actually have it inside the fuel tank just for now. That's okay. So one there and one on the other side. All right, merge them in. Merge this with this, this with this, and we are good. So now we just need to put all of this uh, into stuff and hopefully it will work. All right, so with that being said, fuel throttle, that is uh, ooh. <laughs> that one. Okay, cool. We need this one to go to the fuel throttle over this side as well. There we go. This is the air throttle. So that's that one. This is the air throttle. So that's this one. Awesome. Uh, this is the RPS of the engine. I don't know where that should go. We'll just put it on the crankshaft. Okay, crankshaft. Any of them. There we go. Very good. We then need this to go to a throttle lever or something like that. That's okay. And that's all good. Starter. Yeah. And key. Okay. Fine. Wait. So this actually does have to go to the starter, which is this thing. Uh, this has to go to the starter, which is this thing. We then need a key. Ba 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 bum. Which will go right here for now for testing. And we need a throttle. Which is also here for testing. Bam. There we go. So the throttle goes to there and there. And the key goes to there and there. And that needs electricity. And then all of these guys need electricity. And then we'll be good to go from there. 
Okay, battery. Battery, a big old battery. It's going to go inside the aircraft uh, like this. <laughs> there we go. Attach this straight up to there. Very good. And I think what we'll do is get some uh, floats. And we'll whack them on the side just for now to keep it at least somewhat stable. Is it actually adding them? Yes, it is. So we want this to be somewhat stable as we test this out. There we go. Go! All right, are you going to be stable for me? No? <laughs> Apparently not. Apparently not. Okay, right. We can make it more stable. We just add more. You just, you just add more. It's easy. All right, so actually put this on here like that. Put this one on. This one. This one. This one. Ah, that one, that one, and that one. Very good. Spawn it in. Let's see if this works. Obviously, this isn't even like a problem we should be having, but whatever. Right, so it is working. That's good. Go ahead and jump on here. Do this. Okay, that engine looks like it's running. This engine, on the other hand isn't. Why? Alright, so I don't feel like we've currently missed anything, but I could be wrong. So we'll start the engine up again. Okay, they're revving to maximum now. And there we go. They are actually both working. This one on the left is stalled out though for some reason. But they are both running and they are both working, which is awesome. Uh, so there we go. We've got working engines. Good. And they are modular as well. We didn't have to build them from scratch because we already had some. But that is very, very cool. Why is that one spinning faster than this one? Who knows? I actually have literally no idea. Uh, the gearboxes are both the same. The engines are exactly the same. The fuel, exactly the same. Uh, so I genuinely don't know why it would be spinning uh, differently. But it is, apparently. So there you go. But anyway, that's completely fine. We've built our engines on. That is all I really wanted to do today. Uh, so we'll delete these bits in the middle. There we go. We'll actually get rid of all of these guys as well. And that is where we're going to leave it for today. It seems like a weird place to leave it, but I think it's the right place to leave it, to be honest. I'm going to get rid of this. There we go. We're going to seal this off. And that is where we're going to take our pictures and everything. And yeah, that's awesome. That's really cool.